morning, it's Joanna. Welcome to my channel. Thanks for clicking on the link. I'm really pleased to film this video because I finally reached 500 subscribers. So this video is also going to be my giveaway and I'm quite happy with what I'm giving. Actually, I'm going to show you at the end of this video, but there are lots of really nice gifts for two winners and one of the gifts actually has to do with a happy planner. So this video though is initially about my planner essentials, favorites, things that I use a lot and I'm gonna talk, tell you what they are. If you're new at planning you might wanna buy some of these things cause I'll tell you why I'm using them and why I find them helpful. And these are just, especially in the comments below, I'd like to see what people consider their essentials and their favorites. So let's begin without further ado. Okay, so what are my essentials? First of all, as a planner girl, you need a planner. My planner at the moment is the Wild Styled Happy Planner, which I have customized and I've put lots of inserts in. So if you like customizing a planner, you might want to look at the Happy Planner. Um, I've filmed a video about how I've organized my planner, so I'll link it if I remember. Um, and I'll show you what it is. I like this Happy Planner because of the metallic discs and I think it looks really pretty. But... If you don't know that you will be actually using your planner, the thing you might need is just a notebook, you know, an agenda just to buy and write whatever you want to in it. Because, yeah, so I use my happy planner. I don't have that many things to plan. So for me, sorry, it's uh, more of a creative outlet. I just like using it, you know, just to, um, you know, create and design stuff. So, yeah. That's one thing that I really, really need. Another thing which is boring, but I always use when I'm planning is scissors. So I use my scissors a lot just to cut because I also use a lot of adhesive paper to stick and create stickers. So that would be something that you wouldn't like to use. And I think it's essential um, is adhesive paper to create your own stickers, to print stuff. You might find things online. You can find lots and lots of printables. Um, in lots and lots of planner groups which you can print yourself um, and since I said oh you can hear the ice cream man since I said planner groups that's another favorite and essential is just joining planner groups on Facebook I'm in lots of planner groups like happy planner groups and UK planner groups and UK happy planner groups and loads and loads of groups and I just like getting inspired by the other planner girls and, and boys and seeing what they use and how they use it and that helps me create my own spreads. So as I said a planner, scissors, an adhesive paper, I also use labels quite a lot especially when I want to cover little things up so I have little labels and I also have bigger labels I think they're essential you can also use them to create your own stickers maybe so yeah that's another thing that I think is really important and I use them quite a lot um what else because I'm using the happy planner I also got the happy planner sticker punch whatever I can I'll link in the description box so the box that's underneath my video um so you just create stickers i've created stickers in some of my videos so you can see you just put the paper in here and then you press this you go like that clucks and the sticker comes out so that's really i'm really happy after i got this i and it's the size of my um planner boxes so i'm really happy with that purchase another purchase that is exclusively for the happy planner is the hole punch i got the nine page uh, nine holes hole punch um, and I just use it to create holes in pages when I'm making my own pages or when I've used washi tape at the side of my page just to um, you know punch them again so let's move on to other planner faves and in my opinion essentials things that I keep on repurchasing the hole punch is gonna fall on the floor ah! okay safe I didn't know I needed this in my life I need you know what I mean but I really like die cuts. I had lots of die cuts and I didn't use them, but now I am using it and I've made a spread, which if you look at my planning and organization uh, playlist, you'll find that. So the thing that I use this 
is instead of stickers I use these this one I got from the works in the UK so you should check out the works because they do have die cuts and I just stick them on uh, my planners to decorate them I even use them in my uh, what is it my I was trying to see if I have it there but I don't my binder you know just to stick in pockets and all that so that's uh, something I like another essential is for me because I don't buy that many sticker kits um, they, I really like them but I don't know I don't buy that many I've got a few and I'm happy with them and I will repair and I will purchase some more but just when I don't have a kit I like creating my own so I always buy paper pads crafting pads and I create boxes with my punch here I create little sticker boxes and I use this paper and double-sided tape and I create I stick this paper in my planner and it looks really pretty and I really like it so crafting paper is another essential for me and another favorite one of my staples when I'm creating in my planner what else do you need you need stickers you can buy any type of stickers from a store Poundland I got these ones from Greece bless you if anyone's in Greece bless you has lots of stickers so you can just buy any kind of stickers from any shop Poundland the works anywhere or you could buy sticker books and I have a couple one of my favorite sticker books is the glam girl sticker book I really like it I think it's got beautiful stickers in it I'll just show you the first page I've already flipped through some of these so I don't want to be showing you the same old same old but I really like this sticker book I used it in uh, my planner videos the other day so check this out if you don't have this uh, sticker book the planner the glam girl sticker book you might want to check it out I think it's really nice um, but you don't have to invest in an expensive one you can even buy the minis so there are mini sticker books if you want to buy something maybe you should start off with a mini sticker book and see if you're using it in your planner and then invest in something more expensive um, what else I sometimes use uh, post-it notes for pre-planning because when I decorate sometimes I want to get an idea of what I'm going to write so I might use um, post-it notes I think my next video will be me using post-it notes in a planner video so I can show you how I go about that and I also have um, what are they called what are these called I can't think are they called silver fill index you know index pages so you might create something in your planner and you might want to like a binder planner you might want to have a page tag or something so I really like these ones because they're like metallic colors and I think they look really pretty I don't remember where or when I got these but they are really nice washi tape okay let's go to something very interesting I bought this this has saved me <laughs> I'm gonna link it down below because you should check it out I think it was 15 pounds and it is a washi tape box for storage it's not a planner essential but it's something that I found peace with because <laughs> I can see my washi tape now if you want me to film a washi tape collection let me know in the comments below um, and I just put all my washi tape here and then I have my favorites at the top let me show you some of my favorite washi tape so there at the top I always like white and gold and black and gold washi tape so I'll link some of my favorite washi tapes in the description box just in case you want to check them out and of course another washi tape favorite apart from white gold floral black washi tape is washi tape that has polka dots the works sells this at the moment and in a skinny tape version so you should definitely check that out um, what else I recently bought this but I see lots of people using it that's why I'm going to mention it in my video so this is another thing that I like using some kind I like using <laughs> I will enjoy using because I wanted it to cut my washi tape so a crafting knife and this is the blade I'll link it down below it does cut and that's a good thing it's good when your crafting knife <laughs> cuts things um, pens lots and lots of pens I have lots of nice pens I like using no specific pen but 
I have found that the random ones that are sold by works, the works I really like using, and I really like using calligraphy pens. So when I'm writing in my planner, sometimes I use my calligraphy pen, and that look, makes the result really nice. So that's another staple. And I forgot to mention another type of washi tape that I really like, and it's going to be part of the giveaway, which is coming soon in this video, is lace washi tape. I think lace washi tape is really, really pretty. So I really like the way it looks on the spreads. So nice. If you haven't used it yet. So these are some of my favorite products and my essentials when I plan, especially my happy planner. I also have a color crush binder, which I'm going to do a plan with me later on this month or next month coming up. So now let's move on to my giveaway. Okay, so let's see the giveaway. First of all, there are two gifts. One is UK only, the other one is international and UK. So one gift is only for the UK and I'll explain why. And then the other gift is for anyone, including the UK. So the UK gift is because it's very heavy and it's a happy planner and I think it's harder in the UK to find happy planners. So I thought, well, I got this one. So I'm just gonna give it to someone in the UK. So that's why the other gift is equally as good, but it's not a happy planner because a happy planner would be very heavy to ship internationally. Um, so let me show you the gifts and then I'll tell you how to enter if you want to. So UK only is this happy planner. I bought this, but I made a mistake and I'm not going to use it. So I thought I'll save it and I'll give it to someone who will use it. It is a 20, you see I haven't even taken off the, I'll just take it off to show you. It's a 2020-21 Happy Planner. And it is this, I don't even know what it's called, this flower one. It's got flowers, so if you're not a flower person, this is not for you. So this is what it looks like. And it is an hourly planner. That's why I'm not going to keep it. And I thought, well, if I'm not going to keep it, it should go to someone who will like it. So this is what the planner looks like, uh, the weekly spread. The monthly spread is the same as a normal um, happy planner. So this will probably go to a house in the UK. Unfortunately, you will have the July pages which haven't been used. Um, and it's got really, it's got really pretty like dashboards let me just show you a few things um it's got really nice things it's a really nice planner and i i'm not gonna i don't plan like i don't have that many things going on so i don't need the hourly planner and i didn't want to return and i thought well when i reach 500 subscribers i'll send it to someone in the uk so this is the uk planner and with this i will add the fitness and wellness accessory pack. So this will go in the UK as well. Some washi tape, lace washi tape, as I said, I really like it, and a little bag. So all these will go to one winner in the UK. So that's one giveaway prize. And then the other prize is for anyone, anywhere, and it's a collection of different things, things that I like. So some pens. I think this is my favorite uh, gift from this one. It's a, I think this is a TN. So this is for planner girls who aren't happy planners or who want to try TN notebooks. So it's this really pretty material here. It's like a fur, it's got little stars and it has um, inserts already. I guess you can't add, but maybe you can. You can stick stuff in. It's got the notes, the pages in already. And then you close it like this. This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful planner. And you can use it and then you just tie it up. So this is in the giveaway. Pen for notebook. Some uh, metallic washi stickers. <laughs> a unicorn pen. I've been accumulating things for a long time. So this is why they're all random things. So this pen. Some sticky notes. Here you go. Um, some die cuts, which I got from the Planner Society kit and I never used. 
um, some washi tape. This is, I'm not going to lie to you, this is not very, very good quality washi tape. I'm still giving it, oh, I'm still putting it in the giveaway, but I have better quality washi tape as well. Um, so this one, and then lace washi tape, and this colourful washi tape, which is metallic. Um, this shopping list. With the metal, with a magnet at the back, a stamp because I never use stamps, a crafting paper which is vintage. I have two sets, so this crafting paper and this crafting paper, the garden one which is really really pretty, really pretty. I have the same one to show you. It looks it's got really pretty prints in here, here like this one. Um, and the vintage one I didn't show you. So this crafting page is going to go there as well. It's got this. This page. Really nice patterns you can use. If you like glue books and things like that. You'll really enjoy this. I have one of these. I don't know how you're going to use this. Because I don't know how I'm going to use it. But I'm still putting it in the, the giveaway. It's vellum quotes. They look really pretty. So for example, look, I'll come close. Really, really pretty. I don't know how you're going to use it because I don't know how I'm going to use it because I bought one myself. And another big planner, like a little big, a little big bag, a bag for you to stuff, to stuff stuff in, to put stuff in. So these are the two giveaways, the Happy Planner Bundle and the Random Planner Gifts with the TN, this one, main little planner. Now, um... This giveaway will be open until the 25th of July and um, uh, the only thing you need to do is be a subscriber and leave a comment below. If you have Instagram or if you have Twitter, you can follow me at my pink rambles. It will be easier to uh, communicate with you, but if you don't, don't worry. If you win, you'll just see the YouTube notification. Um, so the only thing you need to do is be a subscriber, leave a comment below. Now, when you leave your comment below, I'd like you to tell me what your plan of favorite things are, like what you use. And I also would like you to say if you are in the UK or anywhere else. If you're in the UK, just put UK and then I'll know. Um, and then I'm going to choose two winners and you will find out on the 26th of July if you have won. So this is just me thanking you for helping me reach 500 subscribers and the next giveaway will probably be when I hit 1000 subscribers. Um, thanks so much for the support and I'm trying to give back. So yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Just keep in mind that this channel is planner and beauty related. There is a beauty giveaway coming up next week with lots and lots of eyeshadow and lipsticks and stuff. So stay tuned. I hope you enjoy my content. Give this video a thumbs up and read the rules in the box. Don't forget to comment. Make sure you're a subscriber. Say if you're in the UK. If you can, follow me on Twitter or on Instagram at MyPinkRambles. And I'll let you know if you've won on the 25th of July. Bye, guys.